No one has been found responsible for the picture, which appeared on a whiteboard in a jail office in 2018. It's alleged it was left on display for anyone to see and photographed to be passed around other staff. Lawyers for the man are seeking damages for his injury and loss, describing the image as a vile and racist caricature of the plaintiff as being another Indigenous person they wish to see die in custody. The drawing came to light after another Indigenous prisoner took his concerns about it to the Human Rights Commission last year. The jail apologised and promised to change. Nothing has changed. Nothing will change until they change their attitudes towards the, the people that they have a duty of care to. Julie Tongs wants a royal commission into the treatment of Indigenous people at the jail. She says the man has had long-term mental health issues and needed better care, not a court case. They should have been looking for the, the people that, or the person that done that derogatory um, drawing and uh, called them to account. The government agrees it breached its duty of care but will fight claims the man was harmed by mental distress and loss of human rights. The case has been listed for next month in the ACT Supreme Court. Elizabeth Byrne, ABC News, Canberra.